St. Gemma's Art and Needlework, and www.allfreeknitting.com are happy to present a knitting tip, how to find both ends to a skein of yarn. This time I will be showing you how to start a skein of yarn using either the outer yarn end or the harder to locate center pole end. Finding that yarn end in the middle of the skein always baffled me when I began knitting, so I hope this video will help you guys out. Starting with a fresh skein of yarn, we are going to find the outer yarn end first. It is typically found in one of two places, underneath the yarn label or tucked inside one of the skein openings. No, nothing there. Must be the label. Hmm, I wonder where... Oh, there it is. Okay, we got the outer end. Now for the center pole. Stick your thumbs and index fingers inside the cavity of the skein and try to feel for a clump of yarn, right in the middle. Take hold of it with one hand and pull it out of the skein. Looks messy, but don't worry. Keep pulling the clump away from the skein until you spot one strand connecting the two. There it is. Take hold of this strand and start wrapping it around one side of the skein. Now you have to wind the rest of that yarn clump you removed. Do this in sections by forming small yarn piles from the yarn clump and then winding each pile onto the skein. This will help you avoid tangles. Here is what I do when a tangle starts to form. The trick is to keep everything loose and pull the strands of yarn on both sides of the tangle. We're all done winding, so now you can pull the yarn end easily, and after a few yards are used up, you will begin to pull from the skein's center. Now that's easy peasy knitting. This video was brought to you by St. Gemma's Art and Needlework and www.allfreeknitting.com.